All right. I have no injuries. <laughs> yes. Yeah, listen, I'm, I'm happy for the Hunt family, uh, most of all. I mean, they, um, they, they've been through a lot um, over the years, and uh, for them to have this back in their hands, I think, is tremendous. Um, and then for the city of Kansas City, um, it's great. I mean, uh, I joke the guys over here about there are going to be some burdens flying tonight, man. So I, I wish I was there to join them. It's, um, and then for our team, I mean, I, I told them that I'd coach another 20 years if I could have that group right there, man. They're, they're a beautiful bunch, resilient, tough, tough-minded, dirty, tough-minded, as you saw tonight. So I'm so proud of them. Yeah, no, he did a great job. He, uh, he kept firing. That's what he did. So, um, and the guys around him just believed in him. I mean, it was uh, we all did. I mean, all the coaches likewise. And and then our defense had some, uh, you know, just a couple great stands in there. And um, you know, we knew it'd be a close game. Felt that way. And uh, we knew there would be some challenges, and we, that we'd have to battle through. And and uh, nobody nobody lost their poise. They just kept rolling. So. I was proud of everybody there. Hey, 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 hey. You were receiving the whole playoffs. That's it, Kusasas. What did you choose to say to players by having to be in that circumstances? Yeah, so well, I haven't had a chance to talk to him yet, but I, uh, on the field, I just said, hey, keep going. We're going to be okay. We'll, we'll start making some plays here. We've done it before. We'll, we'll do it again. And, um, and, you know, we did. So, I mean, it, uh, go ahead. You, you got that suit on, man. Doggone. I'm liking it. Get far away. Uh, well, Coach, uh, of course, I had to go up all night to know, but the year was still the same. Uh, could you talk about the role of Christian Dirty Ice? We talked a little bit about it, the velocity as a chance to get a match here, and just why it's coming back and bounce over the afternoon to the championship. Yeah, so the guys, uh, just last year losing to the championship game, I think the effect that had on the guys that they, they felt it getting that far and then being that four inches off. And it wasn't D Ford, it was all of us. I mean, we were all four inches, we could have done four inches better. And so this off season, you know, they put their mind to it and, and um, as did the coaches and everybody up their game. And, you know, this is the result. I mean, it's, it's phenomenal. I'm not sure it's all sunk in, but it's, uh, it's awesome right now. Yeah. You know, that never crossed my mind. Um, I, <laughs> I've been through it the last three, a couple, three weeks here, so um, I, I just felt like if we got it straightened out and we could just kind of find that accelerator for a series or two, we'd be okay. And you know, we were able to find that, and uh, on both sides of the ball. So, and then special teams did a great job of making them drive long fields. So. It was a you know all around team effort. And, 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 and that remark about wanting to coach another 20 years, uh, maybe you're joking about that, but you must be excited to see where Mahomes career goes. Yeah, no, listen, I'm I'm really excited. I mean, about it. Uh, um, you know, you want to go get it. You get one, you want to go get another one. We'll get we got back pedal for about a minute here and, and uh, enjoy this one, and then uh, we'll get busy on the next one. Hey, 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 can we hear the can we hear the Patrick Mahomes impersonation now that you've won? No, I'll get that to you when he's ah, inducted in the Hall of Fame. Andy, some of your former players in Philadelphia are sending out messages tonight how much they were rooting for you. Brian Dawkins said he shed tears tonight for you. Yeah. And, and a lot of Philadelphia wanted to see you get this Super Bowl. What, what does that mean to you, the support that you have? Yeah, John, listen, I mean, I, I loved my time in Philadelphia. Phenomenal players there. We were so close, I mean, you know, so many times. and. Uh, I mean, my heart went out to those guys. There's one thing that hurt. It was for the Lurries and 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 uh, the players. So there's a, this is a pure team effort. So um, I, I just uh, I'm happy for them. They have a little piece of all of this. I mean, um, and then for the Eagles to do what they did a couple years back um, with Doug. And so I mean, it's that's a special city, um, and they've had some great players there. Uh, it's great to see them still involved with the city. So. 
um, you know, again, I appreciate it. It's humbling I mean, to think about all that. So, but I, I do appreciate every bit of it. Yeah, you know, I, I don't care about that. I mean, I really don't. Um, this is a pure team sport. I love that part of it. I mean, that's why I got in it. I didn't get in it to, you know, for any other reason other than to win games and uh, to win them with great people. And so uh, we bust our tail to do that as coaches and players. Um, that's a part that I think needs the respect. And, and so the other stuff, you take care of that, everything else happens. And um, that's not really where my mind my mind goes. I mean, it's really the last thing on my mind. Damien, I thought did a great job. You know, I thought Sammy, Damien, Tyreek, I mean, you know, the, the offensive line rallying around the guys, but Damien's put together three games now that um, have been powerful. So uh, when needed, he just bared down. And uh, that 95 week there at the end with Sherm in the backfield, that's old school, an old school formation. So uh, two double tights, two backs, and um, it's nothing but power, power football. And, and uh, you know, for him to pound it in like that, I just thought it was great. Right here, Sam. Yeah, you know what? The guys were jumping on top of me. So, I mean, it was – and I got an ice bath and everything. I mean, it was one of those. So, I didn't have a lot of time to reflect on anything uh, other than trying to keep guys off the field. We still had a minute or so left to, to go. So, anything can happen, you know, as you know. But um, it, it was awesome. I'm in there just to be able to celebrate with the guys who worked so hard, you know, to – to get you to this spot and or to get themselves the team to this spot i mean and to see how excited they were these guys were out of their minds it's, uh, i can't wait till i get with them and you know be able to enjoy that part yeah that was that was great um i've been getting with her for about 40 years now so uh, every day is a special day I'm telling you, it's my, I call her my girlfriend for that reason, Vahe, so you never lose interest if you do that, right? You guys out there, I'm your girlfriend, you always do special things for them, so it was, uh, um, I appreciate that. Um, Patrick, I, I don't know what we said, but it was it was good, and we were probably just goo-gooing over what just happened, I don't know, but it was, um, I mean, that brings it, this brings it, brings it out in you, Vahe. Last two, we'll go Herbie and then over there. All right, Herbie, welcome back, man. Thank you. Good luck, Sean, right? That's right. Uh, I know you, you want to absorb this win, and there are a lot of things that are going to happen outside of football. Have, have y'all considered what, what you will do when an invitation or if an invitation comes from the White House to the team that has Oh, man. I hadn't even thought about that. Um, I mean, I'll be there. So, I mean, they're, they're inviting us. I'm, I'll be there. So, I mean, that's, that's a, it's quite, a, quite an honor, I think. Last question. Yeah, so I'd be, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention Brett Veach up here and the job that he's done bringing players in and uh, the competition that's been been uh, presented to these guys uh, throughout. And, and then the, the zest that it gives you uh, to be creative as coaches and um, to try to utilize these guys uh, strengths and ability so um, it's not it's not all Patrick um, he'll be the first to tell you that but it's a good place to start and and uh, continue to build that competition will be the most important thing that that we do there um, as, as we keep going and uh, unfortunately things change in this league I told the guys that last night they know that but I may mean, have reminded them that he'll never be the same as it is tonight which is you know that's the sick part about this job but because um, this is such a unique group. Last question. Last, we're done. We're done. We're done. What's that? Well, yeah, I mean, I joked about it. I'm going to have a double cheeseburger tonight with, with extra cheese. Um, I'm going to enjoy it with my family and the team. That's what I'm going to do. You know, that's, uh, that's exciting. What's up, sports fans? Breon Page here with Fanatics View. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. If you enjoyed watching and you want to see more content, subscribe down below.